By tonight, we starve. The heck? What is that? I don't know. Some kind of meat? That's a baby, dummy. It's a baby, dummy. So now what? Do we throw it back in the trash? And keep looking for those beans. What? No! This baby is a precious gift from Mother Nature, and he's all alone in the world with no one to take care of him. Everyone knows the orphanage is no place for a kid. Uh, I a don't... new member means a new best friend. Maggot, how good are you at gambling? Any bank heist or fraud experience? Oh, we can teach him the old slick and slide. Oh, yeah. <sighs> Vinny, do you remember how we didn't make enough from pickpocketing last week so we had to eat shoes? Eh, the shoes weren't that bad. They tasted like all the other shoes I've had. No, I mean... How the hell are we gonna raise a baby if we can't even take care of ourselves? Hey, you were in maggot shoes too, remember? Me and Skip found you sopping wet from the rain. You looked so dumb. <laughs> anyway, maggot's part of her crew now. Losers like us. We're all we've got on this bitch of an earth, so... We gotta stick together. And then you just do the worm. Or, I guess in your case, the maggot. <laughs> Wow. Hey, uh, welcome to the team. Ah, stone. <laughs> uh. oh, you stupid piece of paper! Attacking our fetus friend like that? Just who do you think you are? Charge! <laughs> Excuse me. Pardon me. We gotta get the best spot for our bougie little boy. First up is reigning champion Taylee, who can do a backflip, but only when you're not looking. We've also got Jaden from the Braden family, who can perform telepathy, but only with himself. Next time you talk about winning, you better think twice. You're not gonna believe this, folks. Maggot is doing. The worm! No! The maggot! Yo! That's dead! Even the judges' minds are blown! <sighs> Literally! We all know no one's gonna top that, so who gives a damn about the rest of the contestants? The winner of the 35th annual edition of Ram Shackle's Next Top Sweetheart is... Maggot! In your fancy garbage. Maybe if you lived on the streets too, you'd... I don't know. Empathize with people? Wanna hear some folk in the alternative? No? Okay. do grow up last. Though you too are flawed, and God forbid you three reproduce, your hearts be kind and well-intentioned. For the milk of your kindness, I bestow upon you three cents and an eight-ounce can of hickory-smoked beans. This one's for you. Yes, one final thing to address. Divine judgment! Bye, you Maggie! Bye, Maggie. Bye, Maggie. Bye, Maggie. <sighs> I'm really gonna miss the guy. Yeah, now I'm stuck with you two idiots again. Hey, didn't they say something about beans? <laughs>